All right, now we're going to solve the cross product using the distributive method for negative B cross A. We're going to prove that negative B cross A is equal to A cross B. So we write down the uh, general form for B. Uh, this is going to be negative B X I minus B Y J minus B Z K. Crossed with A, so A X I plus A Y J plus A Z K. All right. Double checking everything. Uh, B X B Y B Z I J K. All three are negative. A X A Y A Z I J K. Okay. Good. Now um, double check everything because it's very easy to make a mistake using a distributive property of vector. So uh, let's multiply this times all three. Uh, negative B X A X. I cross I minus B X A Y I cross J minus B X A Z I cross K. All right, double checking. I cross I, I cross J, I cross K. Negative B X, negative B X, negative B X, A X, A Y, A Z. Good. Now, plus negative B Y A X. J cross I minus B Y A Y J cross J minus B Y A Z J cross K. All right, double check everything. Negative B Y, negative B Y, negative B Y. J cross I, J cross J, J cross K. A X, A Y, A Z. Okay? So far, so good. Next line, negative BZ, AX, K cross I, minus BZ, AY, K cross J, minus BZ, AZ, K cross K. Okay? K cross I, K cross J, K cross K. Negative BZ, negative BZ, negative BZ, AX, AY, AZ. So everything is cyclical, so everything is good so far. Now, I cross I, J cross J, and K cross K are all equal to zero from your notes. So we're going to zero those out. And we will use the right-hand rule to figure out I cross J, I cross K, and the rest of the cross products. I cross J is going to be I cross J is positive K. I cross K, I cross with K is negative J. Double checking, I cross K is negative J. All right, J cross I, J cross I is negative K. J cross K, J cross with K, J cross with K is I. K cross I, K cross with I is positive J, K cross J, K cross with J is negative I. Alright, now we can uh, simplify this, getting rid of everything uh, that we don't need and uh, crossing out the negative signs. This is going to be negative B, X, A, Y, K. Negative, negative become positive, so plus B, X, A, Z, J, plus B, Y, A, X, in the K character correction, minus B, Y, A, Z, in the I character correction, minus B, Z, A, X, in the J character correction, plus B, Z, A, Y, and then I care direction. And now that we have that, we can underline like directions. I care it, I care it, J care it, J care it, and we won't bother writing anything under K. And let's group these terms. Uh, B, Z, A, Y, minus B, Y, A, Z, and that's in the I care direction, plus the J care direction, 
positive terms first, negative terms second, bxaz minus bzax and the j character direction plus the k character direction is going to be byax minus bxay in the k character direction. Now, um, in the cross product here, this was negative b cross a, so b was first. But when you multiply, it doesn't matter what comes, what term is first. So ay times bz is the same thing as bz times ay. So if we take this and rewrite it directly underneath what we wrote from a cross b, they should be the same. So ay bz minus azby. and that's in the i character direction, plus azbx minus uh, axbz in the j character direction, plus axby minus aybx in the k character. And uh, this shows that we've just proved that A cross B is equal to negative B cross A.